Guys, it was the start up and drive on my Nissan Pathfinder. I actually didn't change the start, I just tapped it, but I pulled it off and put it back up there because it looked kind of uh, like it's been a tight spot. I want to get some more insight on before I just pull it all the way out. But here's the start up. If you guys know, been up here with me on the Nissan Pathfinder. It's my 2000 Nissan Pathfinder. Start up and drive. And uh, yeah, I, I didn't, um, I just pulled the starter off, but it looked like it'll be tight coming out of there. So I'm gonna wait to get some more information on how it's really gonna be firsthand before I really just go ahead pulling the whole thing out of there. So um, as you can see though, it runs pretty good. I just don't like that cracked windshield. I don't know what happened there, but uh, it was like that when I got it. So, you know, it is what it is. But she run pretty good though, as you guys can see here. As you can see, it ran pretty good. That's okay, y'all, for a ride with me a little bit. All right. And these sound pretty good. The only thing I don't like about this is um, shipping gears, you know. That's why I don't really drive it too much like that. And shipping them gears is kind of aggravating, you know. Around town, a lot of times it's leaving in one gear. Like you see me doing here. I leave it in one gear. As you can see here. Alright. Right, guys, we just cruising through town. These are pretty good on gas as well. It's not bad at all. You know, it's a V6, so ain't that bad on gas, none of that. Then it's a V6 model. Right, so we're just cruising on through. All right. They want to ride y'all a little bit. Y'all never been on a ride with this, eh? <laughs> Nissan's pretty good, but they got some tight spots up under there. I pulled the starter off. I want to make sure that I can get a clear, uh, pull it out in there clearly. I had it off though. First one, click, click, click. I just tapped on, I had it off and beat on it. Then I just put it back up there. So I can wait till another day where I can attack it or whatever for good. Okay, you guys on back to the crib. She ran pretty good, but I like I said, I got keep I ride in third gear mostly around town, sometimes fourth gear when I get on more of the traffic though out there because uh chip them gears could be a hack of eight. That's the only reason I don't really care too much for um, shipping those gills like that. As you can see here, all right, guys, we headed back in the yard now. There we have it. She ran pretty good so far. I 
I gotta hit y'all on the next one, man. It's on my 2000 Nissan Pathfinder. It's all the same, all the way from a 96. You know, it's got the same body style and stuff. So I hit y'all on the next one. I'm out. Peace.